Hallelujah. Hallelujah to the Lord God Almighty. Hallelujah to Jesus Christ. Hallelujah to the King of Kings. Hallelujah to the Savior, the one who came and died 2,000 years ago and saved the world. The one who came and died and saved the world. The one who finished the work on the cross. The one who rose again. Hallelujah to Him. In the name of Jesus Christ. My friend, welcome, welcome, welcome to yet another video proudly brought to you by GFM United Prayer and Revival Ministry. I'm Evangelist Gabriel Fernandez and I'm here right now. I was praying with my brother and there's such an anointing, there's such a power of God in this place and the Spirit of the Lord led me to pray. Now I want to pray for you. Total deliverance. You must receive a deliverance in your life wherever the enemy is attacking you, wherever there are problems in your life, and they are tormenting you and troubling you. You must receive a complete deliverance now in the name of Jesus. My Father, my Father, we lift up your name. We glorify your name. We magnify your name. We praise your holy name. Come on, my friend, you know how this works. You know how we pray on this channel. We lift up the name of the Lord first. Lift up the name of the Lord. Take your device, take your tablet, wherever you are. Take your tablet, take your device, go somewhere private where you can pray without any limitation, where you won't be disturbed. Pray, pray, pray. Go somewhere where you can pray. Let us begin by lifting up the name of Jesus. Father, you are the Alpha and the Omega. You are the beginning and the end. You are the all-consuming fire. You are the King of Kings. You are the Lord of Lords. You are the God of Gods. You are the Alpha and the Omega. We worship you, God. We lift you up in this place. You are worthy to be praised. You are the one who supplies for me. Come on, my friend. Say it in your own words. Tell him who he is to you. You are the one who supplies for me. You are the one who delivers me. You are the one who is going to deliver me. You are the one who supplied yesterday. You supplied today and I believe you will supply tomorrow. You are my God and you are the one I run to. When I need help, I run to you. When I need help, I run to you. I am righteous through Christ. I am righteous through Christ Jesus. I receive the finished work of the cross. Right now in the name of Jesus. I receive the finished work of the cross. Right now in the name of Jesus. I receive the finished work of the cross. My dear friend watching this video, my dear brother, my dear sister, wherever you are right now, say, I receive the finished work of the cross. Say, I receive my deliverance now by the finished work of the cross in the name of Jesus Christ. I was here praying with my brother and uh, the Lord just led me that I have to pray for you for deliverance. Some of you have messaged in. Evil spirits have been tormenting you. They've been tormenting you. They've been troubling you too much. Now it's time for you to be set free. Some of you people have been attacking you. Some of you people have been coming against you. Some of you people have been causing problems for you. You're going through unnecessary problems, stagnation, all sorts of things. You find your life is not moving. I'm praying for you now. You should receive your deliverance. And I want you to do something. Download this video. Download this video and play it over and over again until you receive your deliverance. Can I tell you something, my friend? The people who receive from God are the people who say, no matter what, I am going to go to my God. I am going to pray until something happens. I am not going to give up no matter what. No matter how the situation looks, no matter how things may be, I am not going to give up. I am going to push. I am going to pray until something happens. If my breakthrough doesn't come today, I am going to continue praying even tomorrow until my breakthrough comes. Even if it doesn't come this week, I am going to pray until it comes and it will come in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Let us now begin to pray. I'm going to pray for you, my friend. God has put such power on me right now. The anointing is so great right now. I pray for you. Wherever you are, distance is not a barrier. Distance is not a barrier. In the name of Jesus Christ, I rebuke every evil spirit that is coming against you, that is trying to attack you, that is trying to attack your house, that is coming and forming uh, weapons against you. I rebuke that evil spirit right now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. The Bible says, No weapon fashioned against you shall prosper. And every tongue that rises against you in judgment you shall condemn. Right now, we destroy every weapon that is fashioned against you by the power in the name of Jesus Christ. The Bible says in the book of Acts chapter 3 verse 16, There is power in the name of Jesus Christ. And we use that power now to paralyze every weapon of the enemy that is coming against you, against your life, against your job, against your finance. We paralyze that weapon now with the power in the name of Jesus. And we decree and declare 
No weapon fashioned against you shall prosper. All negative words, all curses, all evil, all hexes, all vexes, everything bad that has been spoken over you to stop your life. We break it right now in the name of Jesus. We break it with the power in the name of Jesus. The Bible says, the Bible says in accordance with uh, the book of Job chapter uh, 22 verse 28, it says you shall decree a thing and it shall be established. Right now I decree and declare you are free in the name of Jesus. 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 Even as I, if, as I declare right now, my friend, the Lord is showing me finances. Some of you are struggling in the area of finances. You are being bound in the area of finances. Right now with the power in the name of Jesus Christ, I decree and declare, be set free now in the name of Jesus. Be set free in the name of Jesus. Be set free in the name of Jesus. Be delivered in the name of Jesus. Whatever evil spirit of poverty causing poverty in your life we set you free from that spirit now in the name of Jesus I decree and declare your life shall be changed forevermore your life shall never be the same again your life is changed forevermore some of you are, is, are experiencing spiritual attacks spiritual attacks over your life you can't sleep at night because they come and shake you awake right now receive your deliverance in the name of Jesus receive your deliverance in the name of Jesus take authority right now pick up your divine authority in Christ rebuke that situation say you evil spirit coming against me i rebuke you in the name of jesus i put a stop to your works that are coming against me in the name of jesus say it with me my friend and say it in faith say it in power there's power in the name of jesus release that power in your situation in the name of jesus i rebuke every evil spirit that is attacking my dear brother who's watching this video my dear sister who's watching this video i decree and declare divine deliverance in the name of jesus I release divine deliverance over your life in the name of Jesus. I release divine deliverance over your life in the name of Jesus. Right now, my friend, I see the warrior angels. I see the warrior angels of the living God going out and effecting a change in your life. They are coming to wherever you are. Distance is not a barrier. They are coming to you right now. Just say, Lord, send your warrior angels. Say it with me now. Say, Lord, send your warrior angels to come and fight every evil that is attacking me. I pray this in the name of Jesus. Father, you said, whatsoever you ask in the name of Jesus, it shall be given unto you. Lord, I am asking. Say this with me. Say, Lord, I am asking for divine deliverance in my situation. Put a stop to every evil attack. Put a, a stop to every warfare attack. I pray this in the name of Jesus. And I thank you for it, Lord. In Jesus' mighty name. Now, listen, my friends. Some of you are experiencing demonic sicknesses. You are finding that you're sick. You're finding that in your body there's some kind of pains and there's issues in your body. When you go to the doctor, the doctors can't find anything. Right now, I pray for you. Be released from that spirit of infirmity in the name of Jesus. Be released in the mighty name of Jesus. Be set free in the mighty name of Jesus. Be delivered in the mighty name of Jesus. Be delivered now in the name of Jesus. Wherever you are, receive your deliverance in the name of Jesus. Say, I receive my deliverance. Say it, I receive my deliverance. And say it in faith. Receive your deliverance now in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. My friend, I decree and declare, according to Job 22, 28, you are free from that spirit of infirmity in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Now, some of you are struggling to pray. I'm going to pray for you right now. It's a spirit that's causing you not to be able to pray. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, I pray for my dear friend who's watching this video. Lord, I pray for my brother. I pray for my sister. They are struggling to pray. They are struggling to bring prayers up to you. Lord, I pray that you will do a divine thing in their life. Bring a divine change, Lord. I pray this in the name of your son, Jesus Christ. Let there be a divine change in their life, a complete change. Let them see that they are able to pray now. Whatever spiritual evil weights were tied to them on their wings so that they couldn't fly to you in prayer, Lord, so that they couldn't come up and pray, getting tired when they want to pray. Lord, cut off those evil weights, Lord. I pray in the name of Jesus. Lord, I pray for my dear brother. I pray for my dear sister. When it comes to the time of prayer, may my friend who is listening to this right now, my brother, my sister, wherever they are lord may they receive the, the the glory of god on their lives may they receive an encounter may they have an encounter with you i pray in the name of jesus when they pray when they decide to pray let them have divine energy some of you my friends when when you want to pray you start feeling sleepy why are you feeling sleepy that sleepiness is not natural we rebuke it now in the name of jesus when you pray you'll be able to pray in the name of jesus christ of nazareth in jesus mighty name i pray for you be set free now in the name of Jesus. Be set free from every evil spirit that will stop you to sleep. 
in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. It is finished. I hear the words, it is finished. It is finished. It is done. My friend, we've come to the end of the prayers. I trust and believe that God has done something in your life. Make sure you download this video. Play it over and over again. If you haven't received on the first time, you will receive on the second time. If you haven't received on the second time, you will receive on the third time. If you haven't received on the third time, you will receive on the fourth time. Just continue doing it over and over again. Continue playing it over and over again until you receive your miracle. Let me tell you something, my friend. There is a God. There is a God. If you just look around, if you look at the stars, if you look at the skies, if you look at everything around you that was created, it shouts out that there is a God. There is a God and He lives. And you can access His presence. You can come into His presence. You can come back to Him. You can be reconciled back to Him through His Son, Jesus Christ, who came and died for us. The Bible says in John 3.16, For God so loved the world that He gave His only begotten Son, that whosoever believeth in Him shall not perish but have everlasting life. God so loved you and you can access this divine power through the Son, Jesus Christ. The Bible also says in Acts 3 verse 16, it's the name. There's power in the name of Jesus. So begin to use the name. Pray as you play this video over and over again. Pray in the name of Jesus and believe that this living God will deliver you and you will see a change. In saying that, we come to the end of the prayer. For myself, Evangelist Gabriel Fernandez, God bless you. God keep you. God make His face shine upon you and be gracious to you. In Jesus' mighty name, Amen and Amen. Until we meet again next time, Shalom and Goodbye.